we are yet again back. I gotta be very careful with this and click no. Okay. <laughs> now, what do I do? I guess I'll head back. Um, hold up. Let me, let me, let me read it again, because it was saying, um, so once you visit everyone, you're given a prompt to leave and make sure to click no. Head to Juness Food Court. Okay. Head to Juness Food Court. Oh, guess I gotta go all the way over there, which is far away. Okay. We are, oh, we're already on the first one. Okay. Let's click this and click. Okay. And head over to Jeunesse Department Store, and head over to the food court. Yes, let's do it. Okay. The usual food court. Uh, this is where you had spent so many afternoons going over the case with everyone. Just sitting here brings back a lot of memories. Huh? <sighs> What a coincidence! It must be destiny! Oh, so you guys came here too! It's our very own special headquarters. There are so many memories here. Yeah. Yo there, senpai. Thought you we had a feeling we'd run into everyone if we came here. We were planning on seeing you off at the station tomorrow, but I was feeling too restless. So I decided to come here. Well... Since we're all here, why don't we have something to eat? Uh, Ooh, let's okay. have steak! Steak! And make Yosuke pay for everything! Will you shut up about your steaks? <laughs> well, we're having steak. <laughs> okay. Dun, 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 dun. You, are me you reminisce with the others. I really had fun in this world. Dude, your whole existence is about fun. Well... What we've gone through wasn't all fun and games. But I gotta say, I've never felt so fulfilled in my life. It seems we've been working on this forever. But at the same time, it felt like it went so fast. We won't ever gather here again like this. Uh -huh. Or... Even if we wanted to talk about it all, there were so many extraordinary things that no one would believe us. Oh, damn. Hold up, guys. I will quickly be right back. Okay, guys, I'm back. I got some water. But either way, hold up. Uh, I disconnect my head. I disconnect my headphones a bit. There you go. Come to think of it, for me, I think it all started when Chie told me about the Midnight Channel. Yep. I think I heard okay. about it from her too. What are you talking about? I don't How remember. How did you learn about <laughs> it, Chie? I guess it was just a random rumor. A lot of girls were trying it out. Huh. I wonder how it started then. Who knows? Maybe someone accidentally came across it? The Midnight well, it Channel. Makes sense. You Many know, people really stay up till 12. Cause of everything. <laughs> I mean, the fog lifted after we caught Adachi, but there's still a lot of stuff that isn't clear yet. It's still foggy over there too. Hmm. Some weird guy might use it to do bad things again. Didn't that Amino something monster say it granted what? us power? Uh, yeah. I bestowed power onto those who could brave the hollow forest. In other words, he gave the power to enter TVs to those who awakened to their persona ability, so that he might use us as pawns to enact his scheme. Hey, that reminds me. Didn't your hand suddenly slip into the TV even before anything happened to you? Does that mean you're an exception? I well, guess. Wait, then what about Adachi <laughs> and Namatame? Those two could go inside TVs before all this stuff about personas, right? What? Then Senpai and the other two could do it for some other reason? <clears throat> Probably, yeah. There must be something you're not remembering. Anything? Oh, uh, that. The Velvet Room. You're the only exception. You had the power to enter TVs before your post persona awakened. And the same goes for Adachi and Namatame. You remember that Nanako gave you something this morning as you were about to leave. What? A letter? Hey, this better not be another warning. The sender is listed as Adachi. 
Huh? It's from Adachi. I'm sure you're surprised to get this letter out of the blue. I'm writing this because there's something I need to tell you. Ever since I made it out alive, there are some things I understand now. It's true that my game's over. As you all insisted at the time, I'll abide by the rules of this world. But as long as I'm in stir here, I can't clean up after myself. So I hope this will give you something to think about regarding this case. There's still this feeling I can't shake. Uh-huh. It's about how it <clears throat> started. About that midnight channel. Yeah. Now I remember, someone told me about it when I first came to town. Before I heard the rumors at the station. And I was intrigued when I noticed that something similar was written on Namatame's reports as well. But, I can't remember who it was that told me. Since Namatame and I both gained our power after coming to Inaba, I have a feeling that has something to do with it. I don't know if any of this will be useful or not, but I hope it can help somehow. Uh, the letter from Adachi ends there. Hmm, it's not very helpful to know that he can't remember who it was. I'm not sure how to put it, but I kind of know the feeling. It's like... I don't know how to say this. Like something's connecting all these things. Something beyond what we can see. Uh-huh. That world. The midnight channel. The ability to enter TVs. They all feel like separate things. You know what I mean? First the rumors. Then the serial murder, followed by us deciding to investigate the case. If they all really were separate, they wouldn't fit together like this, right? There has to be some kind of conductor behind everything. Yeah, so I feel you like think Igor's the behind Adachi it, but I don't know. The one who told him about the Midnight Channel is that conductor? Uh, so you know, Igor's just kind of sus. Again? <laughs> it's seriously just something that popped into my head. Senpai, is there anything like that you can think of? Yes, I can. The power to enter TVs where everything about this case started. You learned about the Midnight Channel from Chie a few days after coming to the town when she told you the rumor. But Adachi and Namatame heard about the Midnight Channel from someone immediately after coming to this town. When you think back, you feel as if something happened to you as well upon arrival here. Or something. Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. Uh, this is a choice, so I have to pick, uh, um, there's something missing, yes, okay, uh, or is there, there's something, I think, I can't think of anything, yeah, there's something. We were involved in a murder case last year, which we six- Hold up, uh, Gina's food court, when I asked again if you want to leave, click no, okay. Seated in solving. But the monster we fought last said we did well in playing our parts. Perhaps this means Adachi and Namatame were players as well. Could it be that from the beginning, this serial murder case was merely a portion of a much larger scheme? And none of Maybe. the people who were directly involved in the case ever suspected it. Hey, this scheme... Could it be the whole thing about filling both worlds with the fog and turning mankind into shadows? So someone was behind the scenes watching us. The culprits. And maybe even that monster. And he manipulated Adachi and Namatame at the very beginning, so everything would come together perfectly? Let's go out into town. We might find something. Although, yeah, okay. you may be the only one capable of <sighs> noticing it. Why? Please contact the rest of us should you come across anything. Yeah, that's why, like, I'm I saying, it's say the midnight, I mean, the freaking uh, velvet room. Heads? Let's go figure this out. Yeah, okay. Uh, who could have given you the initial spark for this power? The one you you met immediately after coming to town was my uncle Dojima. It was Nanako. I think it, uh, I'm gonna put dot, 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 because it's Igor. In any case, you need to see them and confirm the truth. Yeah, it's Igor. That's what I know. So I'm going to head back over to uh, the Velvet Room. Uh, let's leave Jeunesse, yes. Okay. And go to Central Shopping District. And uh, let me save real quick. Let me all save. Uh, save it. Save it. Save it. Okay. I'll save there. Yes. Okay. Now let's head over into the Velvet Room. 
Oh, wait, what? Oh, you should uh, look for her. Okay, I guess I have to talk to Dojima and Nanako first. Um, so I'll go talk to them. And I'm pretty sure Igor is uh, the person that that's behind all of this. Because Igor is just a whole lot of sus. Uh, why aren't they home? Where are they? Dojima's on vac- or Dojima's on like a business trip, so why would I be able to find them? Uh, Okina? Maybe? Hmm, I don't know. Maybe? Let's see, let's see. I don't see anyone. <laughs> Oof. Yeah, I don't see Dojima nor Nanako at, uh, at Okina, so uh, I guess they aren't over here. How am I supposed to find them, though? Like, I don't know where Nanako's school is. Uh, the beach? I don't know. Are they at the beach? Uh, can you hear it? Damn cutscenes, dude. Uh, you have no reason to go here now. Are you serious? Okay. Uh, let's see, let's see. The floodplain? The floodplain or whatever? Uh, is anyone down here? Oh, not it. Uh, what, what are you guys doing over here? Hmm? Did you already meet all your friends? Oh, okay. Yeah. I want to try not uh, to leave fish. here with any regrets. Damn it. Uh, I need to talk to him. Hmm? I want to talk hmm? to you. What's this all of a sudden? You asked Dojima about the first day you arrived in town. The day you first came to town? Hmm, let's see. We were the first ones to greet you, right? Did we stop somewhere on the way home? I'm pretty sure Nanako and I left home that afternoon, picked you up, and came straight back. <laughs> now that I think back to that night, I was called back to work as soon as we got home, so I couldn't talk much. And the very next day, those strange murders started. Sheesh. What's happened since then? It's been one heck of a year, hasn't it? Yeah. Hey, bro. On the, fir the oh, damn. On the first day of Christmas? I used the bathroom there. When oh, I yeah. got back to the car, you were talking to the weird attendant. Oh, uh, the gas station. Yeah, when I first met you, I remember the gas attendant because he was weird. Hmm. Now that you mention it, I do remember that. I filled the tank before you we went home, huh? Uh, yeah, I, I do remember you talking to the attendant there. Uh-huh. I didn't remember seeing him much before, so he stuck in my mind. But I don't know about calling him weird. It wasn't like he looked or acted funny. Yeah. Mm. Come to think of it, I, I never saw that guy again. That the attendant looked weird, but after you talked to him, you looked sick, big bro. I looked sick. Um, don't you remember? I asked you on the way home. Are you car sick? You said you were okay, but that attendant—he was just a little scary for some reason. Huh. Hmm. Well, I didn't know about that. But honestly, I'm surprised you're asking all these questions. I thought you came here just to reminisce. So, why are you looking for the person you met first? Is something going on with that attendant? Do you know him? Uh, not really. It's no big deal. It might be important. I see. <clears throat> just remember that you leave tomorrow. I don't know what you're up to, but you should come back home early. There are some dark clouds on the horizon. We might get some rain soon. Uh... I understand. Okay. The first place he stopped when he came to town was the gas station. Maybe something will jog your memory. Okay, we gotta go back to the gas station now. Because that's that's the place we went. <laughs> uh, let's go back. And go to the shopping district. And go to the gas station. It's right over here. Which I, I cannot go there. Okay, why can't I go to the gas station? On to the velvet room, though. Welcome to the velvet room. How may I help you? You have solved the mystery and deflected the disaster that so nearly fell upon you. Is there something else beyond this you need our assistance with? Yes, I want to thank you again. There's one last thing. Intriguing. So, is there still something that leaves you unsatisfied hmm. hmm what may that be 
Well then, let's take a look and see what it is you might be sensing. Okay. <gasps> wow. That's a lot. Well, what is ah, this? Ah, this is a surprise. Yeah, I don't These know what this is. These are shards of power, allowing one to see through to the truth of things without being swayed by hollow rumors. Interesting. Indeed, you have come here today for a reason. Then yes. I shall play my part as well. Okay, with your big, weird nose. <laughs> it's a ball. It's a ball of that light. That is a crystal of power, which you have nurtured through your journey. An orb that repels fabrications of all sorts, dispels lies, and shines upon the truth. I wanted to do Igor's voice again. I have like, he, he hasn't had any uh, voice lines that he was not speaking. Obtained or orb of sight. Hey, I remembered something about myself. I was born a long, long time ago. I was the unconscious wish shared by people's minds to protect the world of man. To protect Walk the world of the devastation. Of man, fulfill the wish of the world. But people changed. People stopped wishing for truth in life. Or maybe they just stopped paying attention. Eventually, I the can't. me that wanted to protect humanity and the me that wanted to fulfill humanity's wish couldn't stay as one. The desires of man had no bounds, and one day, my other half became its own existence. Much larger than myself. Uh, dude, stop it, cat! I was no, go away! <laughs> with no power or ma I became a tiny fragment, incapable of even clearing the fog without giving my own life to do so. Kusumi no Okami. The rest, you already know. Without my powers, I became a tool, manipulated by the other me. You already know, huh? The of cause course. of it all. The one who created the Midnight Channel and gave you the power to enter the TV. The real puppet master. Oh, who tried yeah. to fill both worlds with fog. Using me and the Sagiri. If you don't defeat her, the world will never be truly clear of that fog. Go. Follow what you believe in. The truth is is right in front of you. Truth is a thing which only appears to those who have observed, considered, and made a choice. At the end of the path you chose lies the truth. Believe in it, and continue without faltering. <laughs> Cat, stop it! Marvelous. Didn't we, like, meet Marie also, like, on the day we arrived here? It seems that you will reveal the journey's true end. One beyond our predictive power. Now go! To the place where everything began. Okay. Oh, let's let's go. It began. It began raining. Okay. Uh, now where do I go? Let me save real quick because you know that happened. And uh, let's go. Uh, where are we going though? Oh, you're here. Hi there. Do you need something? Isn't this where I first? First? What are you talking about? Oh, is this about the part-time job? I'm sorry, we don't have an opening yet. Uh... Do you know, uh, Adachi? Ah, that serial murder suspect? A real tragedy, wasn't it? Um, but the case was solved, right? Thank goodness. Huh. Uh, have you met those two? Never mind, did, uh, did those two come here? Well, that's a weird question to ask. I don't know if it was right here, but I might have met them before. I've been in this town for a long time, so yeah, there's a good chance. But it's not like I knew them personally. If you got nothing else, uh, you might leave me alone. You still need something? Uh, hey, I asked you to leave me alone. Did you miss that? Uh, did you do anything to them? Huh? To those two? Ah, that's right. I remember now. I think I met them when they first came to town. 
So I greeted them saying, welcome to Inaba. But that's all. Just that. <laughs> what about it? What did you do to me? What did I do? <laughs> Don't you remember? I met you. I met you here when you first came to town and did the same thing as what I did to those two. I greeted you. That's all. Remember? We talked for a couple minutes. Hey, mind if I ask you something? Why all these questions? Is there something that's bothering you about the time when we first met? Yes, there is. Did you give me the power? Hmm? <laughs> Amazing! You've reached me at last! <laughs> Let's drop this charade. To be quite honest, I was waiting for you to come. Adachi, Namatame, and you. <laughs> um, it is I who awakened that power within you three. The one who had potential. But having said that, I am rather surprised. You really are troublesome. Holy Jesus, dude. <laughs> Not only did you defeat the two Sigiri I snuck into Adachi and Namatame, but you even saved that stunted dwarf of a life. Are you talking about Marie? Marie? Yeah, okay. Uh, so you're the one behind everything. Are you talking about Marie? <laughs> it's such a foolish thing. What good is saving her life? She is but Bro. rubbish. <laughs> <laughs> the only attendant, for getting dude. rid of that point. He's, he's a real villain. A hmm? true mastermind, bro. <laughs> Don't tell me she was still carrying that around. Oh, excuse me. I was talking about that bamboo comb you have on you. I got it from Marie. Yes, I know. After all, it is a symbol of separation. Which is why I gave it to her as we parted ways. Uh, you remember that Kanji's mother mentioned that when you visited Tatsumi Textiles with Murray, it's an old belief that combs have the power to cause separation. How foolish. That comb was a curse. And to think she treasured it all this time. She must have been desperate for something to cling to. <sighs> There's a limit to how irresponsible you can get. I will not forgive you. Hmm. And what are you going to do about it? The last battle wasn't enough for you. You certainly have the powers I was expecting. <sighs> what do you mean? I saw the potential you had within you. Your friends were drawn to the spark I stirred in you. That's why they're here now, with their awakened powers. Still, I didn't think you'd make it all the way to me. Indeed, I never expected this at all. You're really something. What? You don't remember? When you first came to town, I gave your power a gentle push. Just like this. Huh, what are you doing? Are you in high school? Does it surprise a city boy to see how little there is out here? There's so little to do, I'm sure you'll get bored fast. You'll either be hanging out with your friends or doing part-time jobs. Speaking of which, we're actually looking for part-time help right now. Give it some thought, why don't you? We don't mind if you're a student. Okay. <laughs> you felt an extreme dizziness. You're not the only one I welcome to town with a handshake greeting. I did the same for a few other outsiders like you. A handful of strangers were more than sufficient to stimulate a small place like this. Uh, but it okay. seems the stimulus was stronger than I imagined. Enough to envelop this town with fog, and later lift it. Not only that, you now stand before me as if your assigned part wasn't enough. What? To end everything. To learn the truth? I don't really know. Uh, to end everything. The fog has lifted, and you still are not content? Why such greed? I guess it's the foolish nature of being mortal. Oh no. I am Izunami. Izunami? Amino Sagiri, ruler of the fog, is merely an aspect of myself that I birthed long ago. You awakened to a power I had not imagined. 
You defeated the two Sigiri and the one fragment born from me. And now here you stand, face to face with me. I can no longer ignore this situation as mere foolishness. This may be fate, as decreed by the world. <laughs> okay, what's Very going on? Well, this time I shall pit my full strength against you. But in return, you must come prepared to follow through in your futile resistance. <laughs> I'll be waiting for you there. What? What's going on? Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Uh, after I head over to the summer of floor plan where you find Dochi and Nanako. Yep, yep, yep. You talk to them, you go to the Velvet Room. Uh, you have a massive story where it unlocks the true final dungeon. So we have to uh, do a whole other dungeon. Well, okay. Uh, the one you just encountered was the entity behind everything. Her name is Izanami. You can hear your friend's voices in the distance. Are you all right? Who was that you were just talking to? Did she just disappear? Wait, don't tell me. You told uh, your gathered friends what happened between you and the gas station attendant. So, it wasn't over after all. You're saying this so-called Izanami is the conductor, and she's waiting for us in the other world? Yes. We don't beat her. I'm sure it'll all happen again. Oh, okay. The others aren't far off, so I'll call them up. Yeah, will ya? Tell him this is really gonna close the case. Right. We'll defeat her and put an end to this for sure this time. All right, then once we're all ready, let's meet up at Juness. Uh, you have finally discovered the true cause of everything that happened. Uh, you must defeat this Izanami who waits for you. Uh, if Izanami truly gave birth to Amino Sagiri, then, as long as Izanami is left alone, the town will definitely fall into the fog again someday. And if that were to happen, everyone, all that's precious to you, would become mere shadows. This is the most important task you have faced, and it must be taken care of before leaving town. You must ensure complete peace for this town, where you've lived with everyone. Okay. Oh damn it, I didn't mean to go there. But actually, I'm gonna save right here. Uh, I could save in the TV world, but I'll save right here, and then if there's a save point in the TV, then I will go save that. Um, but let's let's head over into the Juness. Leave, yes. Let's go to Juness department store. Dun, dun, dun. Gather around the food court, yes. Let's go to the food court. Uh, this is finally it! Uh, so many things uh, have happened up until now, um, but now we'll beat this Izanami and put an end to this, right? Yes, but since we were spread out all over town until a moment ago, let's go over what happened. This is the last measure that must be taken. We need to make sure that we end this properly. Uh, enter the TV. I'll do my very best! Okay. Let's, let's enter the TV. I sense a tremendous presence. It's unlike anything we had faced, and it seems like a new area has formed. Of course. I bet it's that lady. She's waiting for us there. That reminds me. That Amino something we beat said stuff like, We'll meet again. If that thing's gonna show up again, let's crush him completely so he can't cause any more problems from here on out. Damn straight. Let's go snap that thing in two. We'll do it and give Senpai a big farewell tomorrow. Let's uh -huh. do our best like always. It okay. is kinda sad that this really is gonna be the last time we do something like, you know, this might sound like a weird thing to say, but it was a lot of fun. That's because we all strove together toward a common goal. There were many things we believed in without questioning them. The culprit's identity, their motives. There were many oh, occasions where we nearly gave up. Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> okay. Uh, it may have been easier if we'd chosen to look the other way. 
but we didn't. Even if we had to fight <sighs> every inch of our way, I want to go on feeling, seeing, touching, and thinking for myself. Yeah. Still, one person alone can only understand so much. That's why we're all here together. Right. All for one and one for all! Hey, yo. So long as someone's <laughs> got your back, you can kick against the pricks no matter how tough they are. This is for our future. Yes. So we can see him off tomorrow with no regrets. Yes. Ew. Yosuke always has to try to make himself look all cool. But he's so pathetic, it makes my skin crawl. <laughs> Probably just fleas on your ratty old suit. I spilled juice on you earlier. No wonder I smell of orangey freshness. Well then, let's do this. Yes. Uh, let's go fight Izanami. Uh, okay, I will save real quick. And then I will pause it here and, you know, I'll, uh, I'll, like, like always, I'll just come back whenever I actually, because this video is long, it's already two hours long, and shortening down the time as much as I can is just going through the entire dungeon, going through the entire dungeon, and then coming back when I'm fighting the boss. But I, I might also skip out on the boss, or I might also pause and defeat the boss off camera but i don't know we will I'll, I'll see when we get there so i will see you guys uh, then okay guys i believe we are on the last floor oh, okay so let's proceed and hope we can beat uh beat her really quickly you know because i want this video to end i want this video to be the last one i don't care how long this video is going to be but i'm hoping it's not too long because you know <laughs> Yeah, I've already had like two other videos two hours long in this series. Well, thank you very much, Ms. Root of All Evil. You granted certain individuals the power to enter the TVs. You created the Midnight Channel as well. And lastly, you started a rumor about the Midnight Channel to raise its public awareness. Is this correct? All oh, save one point. This Midnight Channel you speak of. It is indeed a device to draw hearts into this world. But it okay. was always your individual wills that would determine what appeared on it. Humans ache to expose their suppressed sides, while the prying eyes around them are curious to see them lay bare. The want to show, and the want to see. I granted a window that catered to both. That is all. Uh-huh. Everyone wished to know more about the people who became famous through the media. And the Midnight Channel was there to grant their wishes. Once the person they wanted to see entered the realm formed by human thought, they would appear even more clearly. Next, that's it. I see. So that's how it worked. Are you yeah. saying all you did was give that initial spark to Senpai and the others, then watched things unfold? And the rumors spreading, things going wrong. We're to blame for all that's happened? Goddamn, bro. People's curiosity was at fault? Everything was for your sake. To create the world mankind so wanted. Man struggles to understand one another. You can only truly know a finite number of people within your lifetime. But humans disregard this fact, and try to know more people than is possible. Only by <laughs> comparing yourself to others can you define yourselves. Thus, your ever-present anxiety. Your anxiety causes you to see only what you want to see, and believe only what you wish to believe. As I said, your desire is for a world enshrouded in fog. Uh, no, that's not true. I must agree that the vast majority of people are exactly as you say. But we don't intend to live that way. If we were fine with the world you're making, we never would come this far, damn it! We'll keep searching for truth and figuring out who we are as we go on with our 
We all will. Together. That's yes. right. No more butting into our business. Yeah. We will continue to live in our world with everyone else. That's why. We'll decide our own fate. God damn, okay. Oh. Another Man, cutscene. It's hazy. <laughs> oh, Jesus, what the heck? Yeah. You know we've been through way worse than this thing. This is just the send off our leader deserves. <laughs> All right, time for the grand finale. We got this. Let's fight her. Let's fight Izanami. Knowledge of the truth is not yet drunk with truth. You exceeded your role and became too involved. Now, learn for yourselves whose wrath you have brought down. Let's go! Full throttle! Then come, sinful sons of man. Okay. Uh, let's use skill and uh, Niflheim. Okay, does that much. Okay, then we will use our Zyodax. I also added costumes on them, you know? Chris, Chris, Chris was the uh, freaking Naruto and uh, Teddy is... Yeah. <laughs> this is a gigantic Oh, uh, uh, you missed. You suck, Teddy. You suck. Let's use uh, Agirai. Uh, attack! Okay. Nazio died. How dare you. How dare you not Teddy. Oh, bro. Bro has Hama, bro? Okay. Uh, let's use... Uh, Megiddo. Okay. Um, skills... Uh, Megiddo. Oh, you missed. Are you serious? I'm still... <sighs> Shut up, Teddy. Uh, Teddy, you boosted that. Okay. This Nami is now focused. Are you serious? Okay. Uh, let's use Arrow Rain. Alright, alright, bro. Uh, skills for Naoto. Let's use Garudine. Okay. Hold on, let me an an analyze. So just yourself. like that, okay. Uh, skills, um, Bufu Dine. Okay. What's the matter? Did you intend to defeat me with such feeble strength? Oh, now it's Tokun collapsed. Me. This isn't good. <laughs> but I collapsed. What's he talking about? Now it's like men collapsed. Okay, skills, uh, no <laughs> Or Niflheim. Yeah, that's it. Um, Zeodine? Okay. Uh, skills, gigantic fist. Okay, hold up. Do I have any items? Uh, Dry ice, ball lightning, Tesla coil, uh, hell, um, uh, um, Magatama? What? That's all I have. Uh, let's see, let's see. Um, oh no, uh, H Hirania? I don't know what that does. Uh, a peach seed. Um, I don't know. Let me, let me, let me probably use, uh, Sans and Tama. Don't know what this does though. <laughs> oh, it does 50 damage. Okay. Oh, 
Oh, you're gonna. Teddy, are you okay, you get insta kill Someone me. Heal that's, him. that's good. Uh, let's use uh, Niflheim because, you know, that's my strongest attack. <laughs> okay. Uh, skills. Uh, Garudai. Oh, bam. Oh, no. Uh, I'll go. I'm good. I can't find you an opening. Uh, uh, Hira? No, I can't do that one. Supersonic? I don't know what Supersonic does, but let's try it. I hit evasion rate up! Okay. That's good. Uh, skills... Agida. Okay, close. You cannot close. atone so easily for your foolish pride in stepping into the realm of the gods. Oh, okay. Let's all uh, revive now. Come on, get back up. Okay. Uh, skills. Let's, you know, let's use, you use Niflheim. Because, like I said, it's my strongest attack. Because it does 200 damage. Uh, for now, Oto, though, I will use a Myriad Arrows. And a Mist. Okay. Uh, skills, I will use... I can't use those. Um... Who's the guy? Okay. Uh, skills... Agudai? Okay. Or are you using more Agudai, dude? Those are using Agudai. Okay, uh, Niflheim, like I said, again. <laughs> okay. Okay, close, close, close. Let's use... I'm not moving, I don't, I can't do that. Uh, Agudai. Okay. Uh, skills, Lucidain. Okay, close, close, close. Skills, and Agudai. Okay, one more hit, one more hit, one more hit. Ah, uh, you killed me. Someone okay. <laughs> I gotta use my, I gotta use myself and do the 200 damage. Skills and uh, never hide. It should kill her, right? And it killed her. Oh yeah. Or no, 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 no. I didn't kill her. Never mind. Uh, Zy Zyodai. This should kill her, right? Seems imper impervious? What do you what do you mean by that? I can't kill her. See Fusudine, she still seems impervious. Let's use Agudine. Still seems impervious. Do not understand. It is impossible to defeat me. My charge. It is not impossible to defeat you. I will use Megido. Okay, I will use um Mahamon. And block. Okay. Skills uh Lufu Dine. Damn bro, how do I defeat you? Uh Mudo? Yeah no. Dying, dude. No. You understand nothing I see, ignorant mortals. Teddy, are you okay? Someone heal him. Yeah, bro. Careful, <laughs> guys. Okay. Teddy's health is pretty low. Uh, Niflheim, come on, you have to die. Just die already. Freaking Izanami, dude. Something impenetrable, whatever. At this rate, it'll be impossible to defeat Izanami. You recall what Igor and Margaret told you? That is a crystal of power. Oh, which you a have crystal of power. Journey. An ore that repels fabrications of all sorts, dispels lies, and shines upon the truth. Truth is a thing which only appears to those who have observed, considered, and made a choice. At the end of the path you chose lies the truth. Believe in it, 
and continue without faltering. The orb of sight begins to unmask Izanami's true form. Okay, we're gonna use the ball. And the orb of sight. Uh... Okay. Well then, <laughs> allow me to show you my full splendor. Oh no. What is this? What the heck is this thing? Is your health gonna regen? I am a god. I'll no, teach you no, the not. truth of your minuscule existences. Look out! We've never seen anything like her! <laughs> yeah, her health regen. Are you serious? God damn it. This is a freaking final boss battle. This is the actual I final boss battle. Lose! Uh, skills, uh, Bushi Dai. God damn it. Probably has more health than she had before. Uh, Careful, guys. Teddy's health is pretty low. I didn't ask. I mean, is Nick Teddy, your defense skills, is a little lower. Skills, Bushi Dai. What the? Okay. Okay. This freaking person did fury up there. Yao is got it. What? Okay. Uh, skills. Niflheim. Yeah. Okay. That's three hundred against you. Um, Megidola. Let's go. Okay. Uh, skill. Is the dying? What the? Hold on, let me go. Analyst. It's a strong Ooh. one. Okay. Teddy, yeah. your defense has been lowered. Go forth. Yeah. The stage is already set for your demise. I'll end your lives here. Yeah, no. Curl because that's. Uh, Oh crap, Teddy. you already killed Mao to Teddy, bro? Are you serious? Senpai, your now it's like my, one of my lower. strongest characters. Persona! <sighs> okay. Uh, let me use... Are you dying? Great. And the dead, of course. <laughs> I just keep dying, don't die. Okay. Mom, is dying? Bro. Are you okay? What the heck is this? Okay. Uh Nephilheim. Because like I said, it's uh it does supreme uh ice damage. Uh, skills, I will use Garudine. Okay. Uh, skills, I'll use Meteor Okay. I can still do this. Yukiko has now stood up. Uh, let's use Agudine. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. My skills. Let's go. Right. Oh. Here's nothing. Okay. Um, gigantic fist. What the? Are you serious? I know. Someone okay. heal her. I see how it is. I see how it is. God, hurry up! Hurry up! Hurry up! I don't have all day. Right now. 
and I don't have all day. We're already two hours and 33 minutes into this video. Persona! That's a long time. This video will probably be like the longest video I've made. Uh, I definitely won't do this for a freaking uh, whenever I play. Um, Let's go! Whenever I play Persona 3, whenever I finish that, I definitely won't record for this long. <laughs> um, done. Okay. Getting closer, getting closer. He's almost close to dying. God. The time has come for us to end this. There. You missed. How does that feel, huh? How you hey, ha so You missed. How does that feel, huh? You suck. Okay. Let's see skills and dungeon. Uh, Persona. Okay. Uh, skills. Uh, Megido. This time? Come on. Look at that. It's it's uh it's getting closer, but at the same time it doesn't look like it's going down. Uh, look at that, look how much it is. There's a lot to get there's like little but at the same time there's a lot. This isn't good. Oh, God damn it. Okay. Teddy, are you okay? I died again. I've died for the five hundredth time during this battle. Okay. Skills, uh, and yeah. <sighs> Okay. No, they have the, the song, but like they have it played differently, you know? Let's go! Look how close it is! Okay, we got this! Uh, I'll get down here! Come on! Come on, you can help! We got this! Nah, bro, two twenty. Okay. Um... Uh, now the charging your mind. Okay. Now let's see skills... And... Yeah. Let's see... Uh, look at that! Look how close it is! Okay. Uh, I'll use Agidan. This is my night four. And I will use Bufudine. Okay, 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 okay. I use Agidine again. Look at that! Oh shit, damn it. I forgot Teddy does that. <laughs> Teddy just Come on, get up. Uh, Teddy just get up. just just got taken away, bro. Teddy's like oh, gone. What are they doing, bro? What are you guys doing? Where are you guys go? Bro, where are you going? Yukiko Senpai. Where'd you guys go? Oh no! They just vanished. Oh crap! Uh, that's not good. I have two of my strongest characters, but you know that's still not good. I'll be done. Curses? No, Naoto! Naoto! Oh, don't give in! Please get back up! It's unfortunate that our battle must end this way. A thousand curses, dude. Oh no! 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 Get up! We came so far! Yeah, we did. Where am I? It's all foggy. And there is circles. Your consciousness is fading. Is this where you will fall? Before a powerful enemy? You hear someone's voice. <gasps> Yo, Yumi! Idiot! Always <laughs> insisting on doing everything yourself! Some things you can only do because you're not alone. It doesn't matter if it's a boyfriend, a friend, or family. You'll always have to part someday. But our bonds mean we never truly have to say farewell. 
Yo, Ted, <laughs> Teddy. Sensei, I'll protect you, Sensei. You gave me my life. You're important to me. I'm not alone anymore. Neither are you, Sensei. I'm sure together we can do things that no one could do alone. Next is gonna be Marie. What's up, Marie? Can you hear everyone's voices? The people do not wish for a world enveloped in fog. There are times when they'll stop and think they can't go another step. But everyone, please, okay. grant everyone's <sighs> wishes. Bring light to people's hearts. How am I supposed to do that? Please get up. Just once more. Okay. We're getting up. We're glowing. We are glowing. Look at that. We're glowing. I don't know why we're glowing, but we're glowing. Uh, the hearts of those you formed the deepest bonds with became your strength. Yo, it's uh, he's an ugly. <laughs> okay. Yo, what the heck? Izanagi has transfigured into Izanagi o uh, no Okami. Uh, Okami. I got rid of Izanagi, so but I guess I got him back. <laughs> I got Izanagi back. Missed, haha. Huh? Ah, you missed me. Okay. Impossible. Can the will of so few surpass the will of all mankind? Holy Jesus. How can your powers rival mine? Bro, oh, can you stop it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why? Can you stop it, dude? Why don't you understand? It's impossible for humans to grasp the truth with their own hands. Okay, skill. Myriad truths. Yeah, we took off our glasses. <laughs> Yo! <sighs> Goddamn! Okay! <laughs> We have defeated her. This can't be. How could I be defeated? How am I the one to disappear? Instead of the endless struggle, wouldn't it be easier to wrap oneself in lies and live in blissful ignorance? Isn't that true peace for humans? Uh, no. How many times do we have to tell you? The hell with that shit! Stop assuming you know us! <laughs> Very well. Then try and live your way. Power enough to erase <sighs> my existence. You have already exceeded what I thought humanity to be God, capable this of. This video is almost you three have hours the long. Fog in this world, <laughs> as well as the fog in your own. And whether that will lead to happiness or not. Rests upon your shoulders. Children of man, well done. This video, I'm actually thinking, I'm gonna cut it in half. I'm gonna split this video in half. Uh, so they're gonna be two separate videos. That's what I'm going to do. Cause this video is almost oh, three right, hours long, and I do not want a three-hour long video. Uh, thank goodness. <laughs> Cause this would have been this would be the longest video on it's my channel, really and I over don't now. Really want that. So I'll definitely split yep. it in half. This time it's all over. 
You guys would know that. It seems already. this is more like if a beginning for us, though. In half. So, yeah. <laughs> well, now we've got no regrets for tomorrow. Yeah. Friends, that you can believe in the many people you have come to understand. A strong heart bound to others, trying to assert, uh, uh, trying to ascertain the truth. A firm belief in grasping the truth with your own hands without being misled or deceived. The power of these things has brought judgment down on what deceived mankind. Opening the door to a new tomorrow. Hells to the Yaws. Yo, Marie, what you doing in here? Welcome back. Everything's are you? finally over. Why do you look like this? You really are incredible. I'm no match for you. You just fought the other me that split from my personality. The two Sagiri, the other me, and the me that is speaking with you right now. They were all originally one within me. But okay. there was nothing I could have done without my powers. If not for you, I would have disappeared along with the fog when the hollow forest vanished. Thank you so much. You saved everything. I'll be all right. The fragments you defeated have returned to me and will soon become one. Okay. My name is Izanami no Mikoto. The fertile will that protects those who live in this land and fulfills their wishes. I will not forget you. Please do not forget. Oh no, Murray! Always by your side. <sighs> okay, we got it. we got this card. <laughs> How marvelous! You have driven back a godly being and brought about a new world. Yes, we did it. This will be the last time we summon you here. Soon, the fog will lift and our destination will be visible. We will be arriving shortly. Okay. This journey was a fruitful one, worthy of marking a turning point in your destiny. Many a time along the way, did the fog of lies prevent you from moving forth? Yet in every instance, you overcame the temptation of easy exits and false terminals. In forging bonds with those precious to you, you move closer to the truth, one step at a time. And my heart danced with delight to see you succeed. I am most honored to have borne witness to such a wondrous journey. Our destination is close at hand now. Well then, we have finally come to your journey's true end. Yes. Our contract has been fulfilled. <sighs> My own yeah. duties end here as well. You were truly a remarkable guest. Okay. Oh. We stopped. Now, go forth. And see with your own eyes. See the world you have won. The bright, magnificent future. Ooh, ah. Okay. Okay. It's a cutscene now. Holy Jesus, where are we? Is this is this the TV world? Or no? The I don't know. Fog is all gone. Yeah, we're in the TV. Wow. It's nice. It feels kind of nostalgic. I know this place. This scenery. A long, long time ago, everywhere in this world used to look like this. I'm not gonna lie, I kinda, I think I vaguely remember this from the anime, but I don't know. So this is the world inside people's hearts. Uh 
Oh. Yeah. Okay. The town's fog and the fog from the other world have been cleared. The human heart has the strength to shine through the clouds of lies and uncertainty. You and your friends were able to prove that fact. And that will remain true until the end of time. Okay. Oh, okay. It's now the 21st. Let me uh, read up on this thing, though. It says, uh, The most daunting dungeon in the game has to offer with a high multi-stage boss. Yes, okay. Um, so that's that. Uh, once you overcome the final dungeon, you've get you'll get you'll get the best ending Persona Four Golden has to offer. So sit back and enjoy. Yes. Yo. Well, this is it. Yep. You really are leaving, huh? It hasn't really hit me yet. No more senpai from t tomorrow on. Oh, this part's just the same. Hey. Okay. Sheesh. Uh, we got yeah, this part's the same. Hey, bro. Uh, I... Yeah. All of this part's just the same as uh, the other one. <sighs> Building a case against the Dachis. They have a Nanako. Thanks for everything. To me, you're just as much a part of this family. That one, yeah, remember that. Sensei, I finally found a place for me. That's why I'm going back over there. To make sure it never goes wrong again. I'm going to protect that world from now on. I can finally be proud and say that world is where <laughs> I belong. Man, Senpai. Wow. This town's gonna feel empty without you. How cruel! We can see you anytime we want, you dork. Like you'll be gone long. Soon as you start craving something like ice cream, you'll be back in a flash. Come on, my honeys. Walking <laughs> that way isn't very cute, you know. Shut up, Teddy. You're just gonna be going in and out of the TV at Juness. How's that different from what you've been doing? Um, I can't quite decide what to do. At first, I only planned on staying here until the case was completely closed. Maybe I should stick to my original plan and take the train back with you, Senpai. <laughs> Kidding, of course. <laughs> I couldn't do something like that. It's not as though we'll never see each other again. Feel free to call me anytime, even if there isn't a case to solve. Okay. I don't feel like saying goodbye either. Hey, you got any plans during the long holiday in May? If you're free, come over and visit. With no mysteries to solve, we can have some real fun. I'll make reservations now so that we can stay in my family's inn. Okay. Ooh, I can get my revenge for that night. Our surprise sneak attack will work for sure this time. Oh. Don't bring that up, you stupid bear. Hey, <laughs> what happened to going back to that world? <laughs> that has nothing to do with this. It's entirely different. Okay. That reminds me, she's not here. I would have thought that she would come today at least. Uh, Murray? I talking about Murray. Oh, yeah. I haven't seen her ever since. Uh, is she doing okay? I think so. I'm pretty sure she's fine. She's in our hearts. Wait, what's that supposed to mean? Oh! So Emmy Chan went back there, huh? Oh my! I've got a hottie for a neighbor now. What should I do? Oh, is that what you meant? Oh, I thought something bad had happened to her. Uh, Why'd you have to say it know. like that? I don't really remember what happened. Hey, <laughs> stop ignoring me! Shut up, Teddy. But back to a serious question. She should have at least shown up here, since this is the last time we'll see you. Stupid 
Moranji? Why do you have to say things like that too? <laughs> okay. It's almost time. You better get on the train. Yeah, I'll do that. Okay, and then Yumi's over here as well, yeah. As soon as I can look out for myself, I'll go see you. Yeah, okay. And then it's probably just the Yumi the exact same cutscene, right? Uh just sit back well, and see just ya. watch this this again. <laughs> for there too. If anything happens on your end, we'll come running. Until we meet again, Senpai. Senpai, I'll be waiting for you. See ya. Take care. I'll be looking forward to seeing you again. Well, be careful. I'll see you, big bro. Bye-bye. <laughs> Damn, bro, we said hmm. <laughs> <laughs> We're, I'm leaving. I'm leaving. I'm, I'm, I'm going away. Forever. I'll never come back. No. Stay, stay, stay away. You'll always be I'll my never sister see you. forever! Please don't forget about us over there! Oh, no, it's a crime. Why are they crying? You better not run away too, senpai! I'll always remember our time together! Distance doesn't matter to us! Even if we're separated, we're still friends! <laughs> <laughs> nice. See you again, senpai! Oh, we left. We got left. Dun, 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 dun. Okay. Well, this is different. He's really gone. Yeah, this part's sad new. that he won't be around, but we will be okay, right, guys? Doesn't matter how far apart we are, the bonds we've made will remain strong. Everyone's heart is connected to the people they <sighs> know and trust. <laughs> It's those bonds that let us all search for our purpose in life. As long as it's a purpose you believe in, there will always be someone who can help you fulfill it. You, That's the picture. And everyone else, there are no barriers. Our hearts are one. Right, Sensei? <laughs> Goddamn, okay. And it fades to black. Uh, that's it, right? Wait, what? What? Oh, what? There's more? There's more? Okay. What? 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 Just skip forward. We're coming back. <laughs> we have came back. <laughs> Summer vacation. The town doesn't seem to have changed at all since last time. I have seen the light! I've learned the most important lesson from the events <laughs> last year! <laughs> what are you doing? A man you've seen before is delivering a passionate address to the crowd. Unfortunately, this world is full of things meant to deceive people. The things you do in pursuit of justice may actually be a terrible mistake. One man is not enough to judge these things. It was a group of boys and girls who taught me that. In their spirit, I want to join hands with all of you to rethink this town's future. I want Inaba to be a town free from deceit and distractions that keep you from focusing on the things most important to you. Hey kid, do you know who that is? Uh, yes. He was arrested during those terrible murders last year, right? And now he's running for mayor. That was a surprise. He's so passionate. <laughs> he's running for mayor? <laughs> no one wanted to go near him. But look at him now. I've been to a few of his speeches. I think he might be a pretty nice guy. Yeah. If we can all work together on this and not get so sidetracked by passing trends, this town will regain its former glory. So please, lend me your strength. Please. Namatami's speech continues. <laughs> okay. Namatami. Nobody seems to be here to welcome you. You decide to go to the Dojima residence. Okay. Let's go. Let's, let's go. <laughs> I 
There's no answer. The front door is locked. They seem to be away. He decided to call Dojima. Okay. Dojima seems busy. You decide to call Yosuke. No, not Yosuke. Yosuke isn't answering either. Did something happen? Um, I don't know. <laughs> uh, what's going on here? Uh, Inaba Central Shopping District. You don't see anyone you know. Hey, what do you think of beefsteak onigiri? We can freeze it and sell it nationwide through amazing commodities. Um, what? Hold on. Yeah, it's three hours already. <laughs> Goddamn. Oh, no. Those are handmade, aren't they? I don't think we can mass produce them. Well, on the other hand, maybe limited quantities and handmade are good selling points that could revitalize this town. I thought of moving away once, but I don't think I could bear to be away from here. I understand completely. This is where we were born and raised. We'll have to work together if we don't want it to fall apart. Great news! Uh, Judas said we'll okay. have their full cooperation! Yes! Good thing we went to talk with them. If only we'd done it sooner. But what are we supposed to sell in a locally produced goods section? I guess the steak kebabs are good, but what other stuff is there? We're not famous for anything else. Hey, give me anything, you half-wit! Vegetables, fish, even ramen! As long as it's <laughs> something we put our backs into, it'll sound like hotcakes! You gotta work hard so you don't embarrass Janess! We can't be weak now! The shopping district is coming alive. We decide to go to Janess. Okay. Head over to Juness, I guess. <laughs> We're at Juness! Juness Food Court. Serious, what are you wearing? You don't see anyone you know. Ow! You're going to give us away, <laughs> idiot! Oh, because you were slow! <laughs> slow like a jar of molasses! Shut up! He's going to hear! Ah, oh, blew it! Oh well, here goes. One, two... <laughs> what are you guys doing? This isn't anything like we planned. And what's with the bar? It's a bear. Oh, you make it sound like we're the ones getting ambushed. <laughs> I knew we'd run into snags. Goddamn, bro. Goddamn. I'm sorry. Again, Naoto, dude. I'm sorry. Oh, shit. Senpai! What's up with your hair, dude? Did you miss me? No. I did. Uh, we heard you were coming, so we planned a little surprise. I mean, things got kind of nuts when you last visited in May. We thought instead of you coming to each of our houses, we'd spice things up this time. Yeah, and we thought you'd miss us a little if you could find any of us. <laughs> it didn't go quite like you planned, but it's been a while, senpai. What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck, dude? Were you surprised? <laughs> no fuck. Uh, surprise was- it was such a failure. <laughs> so you were surprised. In a way. <laughs> the fuck is the kanji, dude? Success? No, not a success! <laughs> so hey senpai, how do I look? Did you think I was someone else? Is your heart melting? Oh come on, you know who's changed more than anybody else here. <laughs> yeah. Will you asshats lay off? You're getting a little rude there. <laughs> Seriously, bro. They're wearing glasses. Dude. We have Those all like freaking Ishimaru from uh, My Hero. None of us can remain in stasis forever. <laughs> oh, stop laughing already. 
None of us want to be the guy who's always talking about how great things were back in the day. As long as we're all here, keeping an eye out for each other, we can change. Yosuke's still a show-off. Not me, though. I'm different now. Why, I've powered up so much that I'm probably a grizzly bear. <laughs> Bro, huh. what? Sounds powerful. I'll stick you with all the manual labor, then. <laughs> <laughs> It's me. Did the surprise go well? Uh, it's still ongoing. <laughs> oh, sorry about that. They asked for my help, so I acted like I wasn't home when you came by just now. I'm a pro when it comes to seeing through a lie, but when I'm the one who has to put on an act, I don't last five seconds. Anyway, bring them all back here. I've got a good meal waiting. You told everyone that Dojima is waiting. Oh, really? Let's eat! Uh, hold up, guys. Hold up. Wait, oh no. Okay. <laughs> hey, Kanji! This is to celebrate Senpai coming back! Shut <laughs> up, I know! You decide to go to the, the Dojima residence with the others. Jason, by that's your second one. We get one each, remember? <sighs> you kids sure eat a lot. I thought I might have ordered too much, but look at you. Plowing. <laughs> Sorry about that, and thanks. Isn't Nanako-chan here? I'd hate to eat her share, too. She's a piano lessons. Don't worry, I set hers aside. Oh, didn't I tell you? Yeah, Nanako started learning the piano. She should be back anytime now. I'm sure she'll be rushing home. Ever since she found out you'd be back, it's all she's talked about. <laughs> okay, Dojima's laughing. I'm glad she's doing well. Yeah, me too. She's growing and learning every day. It's an amazing thing to see. Just watching her gives me strength. It's slow, but I'm moving on, bit by bit. Okay. Actually, I came across some information about an old hit-and-run incident. The victim was Chisato Dojima, my wife. I've been chasing dead ends and false leads for so long. But I think I'm finally getting close to the truth. Just when I thought I'd keep my personal feelings separate from my job. <laughs> it's strange. Though, it's thanks to you that I was able to draw that line in the first place. Uh, anything else new? What happened with last year's case? Anything else new? Anything else? Hmm. Oh, about the incidents last year. Uh, Namatame got released on lack of evidence. Yeah, I saw that. <laughs> I can't tell you too much, but basically no one could reproduce his supposed methods, not even Namatame himself. He was very insistent on the details of his crimes, but a diary isn't enough evidence to build a case on. He came to me to apologize, but I told him he should come up with his own way to make up for it. He said he was going to run for mayor. I don't know how serious he was about that. So that was Namatame-san giving those speeches. Oh yeah, and I went to see a dachi. A dachi? What happened to him? Were you the one to interrogate him? No, I wasn't part of that. I couldn't be. We were too close. But he was indicted. It was probably just circumstantial evidence, but he said a lot of things only the real killer could know. After they set a trial date for him, I was able to go see him. Okay. I see. So not now to damn. <laughs> they say he's a model prisoner. The bastard says he gets better treatment behind bars than he did when he was working with me. Huh. <laughs> Next time I go see him, I'll bring him a cheap cabbage. <laughs> Dojima looks happy. <laughs> I'm home. Dad, What's up, Nanako? It's big bro. Big bro. <laughs> Surprise, Nanako. Welcome home, Nana-chan! Teddy, too? And Risei-chan! <laughs> Everyone's here! I'm learning piano now, and I've been a good girl! No, 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 go. Uh, calm down. <laughs> <laughs> but you're here, and everyone else, too! <laughs> this is so exciting! Nah, not I didn't think she'd ask to start piano lessons. 
like mother, like daughter, I guess. Chisato was a piano teacher, but Nanako's pretty good herself. At first, I didn't even want to hear the word piano. Now that she wants to learn, I gotta get over it. I remember what my mom played. I'm gonna play it for you, Dad. <sighs> okay. Dad, the weather report's on. Uh, and, and what? Now, the weather. It was nice and sunny today, but what will it look like after that? Take it oh, away, no. Mariko. Oh, Mariko. Hello, what Mariko the fuck? Kasumi here. So, huh? It's a familiar girl. Hmm. Huh. We've been having hmm. a lot of rain recently, so huh. starting today, I'm gonna make huh. it sunny. I mean, after huh. all that rain, I, I don't think we're gonna have to the, worry about any water shortages girl. this summer. <laughs> but and what the besides, fuck, someone's visiting. I can't have it rain while he's here, so I'm gonna keep it sunny for a while. Mariko. <laughs> Mariko, please calm down. Oh, but if it gets too hot, then some rain should be fine. He should tell me whenever he wants it different, and I'll change it. Just like that. The weather forecaster is Murray. Oh, I forgot to mention. She's been coming here a lot. She's famous now. How'd she get so popular so fast? What was the station thinking? Her stage name's so boring, too. This girl will decide tomorrow's weather, right? Whenever she says it's gonna be sunny, the sun comes out. Uh, in her case, maybe. Thanks, Mariko. <laughs> Tell our viewers goodbye. Uh, yeah, yeah, but before that, a personal message. I'm doing just fine. Love you. What? <laughs> uh, what's that? <laughs> Did, did she just confess her love on a public news show? <laughs> I can imagine the complaints flying in right now. Kids these days. Wait, that, that was your name. Funny you were so lucky, huh? <laughs> uh, bruh. That uh, she is talking about. Have me. a good day tomorrow. Remember, the more you put in, the more you get out. The more you get out. I see that weather girl a lot. The younger ones at the station tell me they feel motivated whenever she does that. I'm not surprised. <laughs> I feel it a little myself, to be honest. Well, I'm just glad the weird fog is gone. Now we don't have to obsess over the weather report. Yeah. It's really great, though. Everyone in town is more motivated. Yeah, people have so much energy now. Yep. You're right. It doesn't wear you down walking through town anymore. Everyone has a more positive outlook on life than when I first came. It shows people can change. For better or worse, I guess. Depends on your perspective. After the fog lifted, I'm sure people just realized that it's a lot brighter when your eyes are open. There's a lot we'd rather not see. A lot of grime in the human heart. But if you close your eyes to everything, you can't even see the people close to you. How can you be happy like that? The only thing to do, really, is to keep marching on, straight ahead. I'm Don't rambling, you? aren't I? Why are you being weird? There's more, <laughs> more to drink than I thought. <laughs> okay. Oh yeah, Nanako, didn't you say there was something you wanted to tell him when he came home? Uh, Your cooking oh, is barely now. food, Chie. What about yeah, mine? Uh, Katsu. Hmm? What was that? I can cook if I put my mind to it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, that's... Mm -hmm. Okay. Gotcha. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Got it? Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, uh, well, then. One and... Well, Good to see yeah. you, Senpai. Come on, G. It was welcome back. Uh, How could you mess that up? They just... Shut up, all right? I can <laughs> <laughs> okay. Guy here, damn. Okay. That was uh, that was the end. Um, P4G Persona for Golden. Yes, I. Is it gone? Am I, the, the, it's it's just okay. It, it's gone. It's gone now. Now it's uh it's the credits playing. Again. 
Yes. God. The, the credits are different, though. <laughs> They're different from the previous credits. Uh, the first one was just all black. The second one was gold. This one looks like this. But guys, I hope you enjoyed it, this video. Like I said, this video would have been split up into two parts, so this is the second part that you would have seen. And yeah, this game, I've been playing it for... Uh, since uh, 2021 December, because that's when I got it. I bought it on, um, on freaking, uh, on my computer, but like, I stopped playing it after a while, I think. I don't know. Uh, and then I went back on my Xbox, I, I know that, because I got it on my Xbox as well, whenever it came out. So, yeah. I don't know, cause, and it came out on Xbox, like, sometime, like, uh, late last year. Uh, so yeah, I've been playing on it uh, for, for a while now. The first couple videos are bad, and then I got to Xbox, started becoming good. Now these videos are better because it's actually HD and not my weird Xbox recording style. But yeah, this game is, uh, is, is, uh, is great. I'm not going... The only time I'm going to come back to this game is just in my spare time just to complete all the achievements. Because I usually like doing that. I completed all of Corpse Party. Corpse Party is fully 100% completed all achievements. And I also fully completed uh, Doki Doki Literature Club Plus. I want to get all the achievements in this game as well. So I'll definitely go back in my spare time whenever I actually feel like it. And then just do all the random achievements that I, I did not do. Um, but yeah, I'm going to uh, wait until the credits end. Just to see if there's anything at the end. You, you never know. You never know. Uh, so yeah, I will. I'll, 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 I'll pause it and then I will. Uh, uh, I will unpause it at the end. Okay, guys. So the only thing that has been uh, new here is this. This is at the end. It shows everyone here. Look at that. Everyone. Yes. This is you know. This is the, the fin. <laughs> Final. Yes, we did it. Let's let's uh, see. let's get this. I forgot what these do. It, it's the new game, but you keep all your stuff in it. You know, that's what I'm pretty sure it does. Yeah. So new game, but you keep everything. It just starts from the beginning, but you keep everything that you've earned and everything like that up until the beginning. So uh, up until to where your point left off. So guys. I hope you enjoyed today's video! The Persona 3 video is gonna be uploaded like either either two days, like either a day or two days after this video gets uploaded. But yeah, I don't know. We will I will see when that happens. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to leave a like and of course subscribe to my YouTube channel. And thank you for the people who actually watched until this very point. And I will see you guys next time. Peace out and Bye-bye.